In Clay County this morning, parents are upset and they are voicing their concerns about how many students have to dart across busy State Road 16 to get to Clay High School. So earlier this week, you may remember we told you about that student who was hit by a car while crossing that same road. Thankfully, that student is okay, as Vic mentioned earlier. The News for Jack's I team, though, took a closer look at what's happening and found out that the Sheriff's Department says that there's a new safety law that could be at the center of why no one was monitoring this area. We want to get straight to News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding. She joins us live this morning from Clay High School. Ashley, you saw it firsthand, the traffic and what students are dealing with on a daily basis getting to school. I'm sure you, as a parent yourself, have your concerns. You can definitely see why these parents are concerned. Vic and Jennifer, good morning to you both. But yes, we noticed that when some students were crossing, they did appear to be a little more cautious this morning, especially when they were crossing right there at that crosswalk. Now, I'll go ahead and tell you, one student actually did tell me there was an announcement shortly after that one child was hit earlier this week, telling them to be more careful, but parents are still concerned. We actually spoke to parents as they were pulling out of here. One was even yelling at us, saying that this is still a terrifying situation, and many of them are very concerned. Something else this morning, we did notice that right behind us in front of the school, there were two law enforcement vehicles parked there. I took a picture of them right here. I wanna pull that up for our viewers to see and I've circled where they are. One has the lights on in the back. The other is in a black car. It does not have its lights on, but they were both here right out front. Now look at this new video fed in just a little while ago showing the students walking to school earlier this morning, shortly before the bell rang. Now parents have told us this is what they're concerned about and they want to see something done about this. They're concerned seeing students cross this very busy state road so early in the morning, especially when it is so dark. Now our I team reached out to the school district with those concerns and the school district officials sent us a response that said, quote, our director of safety and security said this is a state road issue. However, he is meeting with the county public works director this week to dis discuss a request being made to the state regarding additional signage. And we are working with the appropriate agencies to see what can be done to make this area safer. Parents say they do want to see a solution put in place, place quickly, and they say they will be paying attention to the outcome of that meeting. So will we, of course, we will share what we find. Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station.